Here in this video we will showcase all the raptor species in the Jurassic movie franchise. We will include a couple of the subspecies of Velociraptors, the two type of hybrids, and also two more raptors that will be seen in the upcoming Dominion movie as well as another one that is rumored to be included in it but as of now there has been no confirmation. So that's 7 raptor species in total. Anyway, do subscribe before we get into the video. Now let's do this thing. Number 1. The Velociraptor, the Isla Nublar species. The most famous dinosaur aside from the T-Rex, the term Velociraptor is used in the Jurassic Park universe to refer to the genus of Deinonychus. Velociraptors have a major role in all 5 movies. Before the Jurassic Park movie aired, most people never heard of raptors before. We like to believe that there were two types of Velociraptors in the franchise. The Isla Nublar species is the common one that has been seen in 4 of the 5 movies. They were 5 to 6 feet tall and 12 to 14 feet long, hyper intelligent and a pack animal that can run as fast as a cheetah and has featherless body with a narrow snouted head with sharp teeth. They also have sharp talons and claws on both forelimbs and hind limbs. Number 2. The Velociraptor the Isla Sauna species The second variety or type of Velociraptors are the one from the second island which is Isla Sauna. They are the raptors seen in Jurassic Park 3 and they have various color palettes. The upper half of their bodies is purple with the colors strewn around it. The males of these raptors sport quills on the top of their heads. They have head crests that are more elongated and pointed skulls in general. They were also fast, hyper intelligent and has more or less the same features as the Isla Nublar species but are a bit smaller, around 5 feet tall and 11 to 12 feet long. They were also the first to be seen to communicate in more advanced form amongst themselves. Number 3. The Indoraptor The first hybrid raptor that we see in the movie screens is the Indoraptor and this was seen in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. It resembles the Indominus Rex in appearance although its body length is about half of that its predecessor. It has a Velociraptor like talons and its hue is mostly black with a golden yellow stripe going from the base of its neck to its tail. The Indoraptor like the Indominus Rex has 4 fingers, an opposable thumb and 3 primary digits. The shape of its skull is similar to that of a Tyrannosaurus Rex and it also has night vision. This raptor is 10 feet tall and 24 feet long. It was the only one of its kind and was killed by Blue the Velociraptor in the end of Fallen Kingdom. Number 4. The Scorpius Rex This one is actually the first hybrid dinosaur created in the Jurassic franchise chronologically. The Scorpius Rex is smaller than the Indominus Rex, somewhat larger than the Indoraptor. It possesses an odd shaped head and jagged uneven teeth as well as crimson eyes, with slit pupils situated high on its head. Due to its scorpion fish DNA, it has venomous spines on its body. It was featured in the cartoon series Camp Cretaceous. It has opposable thumbs and gripping talons, just like the Indoraptor, and has a semi-prehensile tail. It has infrared vision, which allows it to see the heat signature of its prey. There were two of them who both died in the series and both were around 26 feet long and 11 feet tall. Number 5. The Oviraptor In the original novel, Oviraptor is referenced briefly. It wasn't however one of Injun's cloned dinosaurs. It was also featured in a few video games. But an Oviraptor was plundering a clutch of eggs from an unknown dinosaur during a Cretaceous flashback seen in the Dominion prologue, one of which the dinosaur ate in the process before being distracted by another dinosaur's skull, possibly the owner of the egg. This was the first dinosaur with feathers that we see and is more of a precise description. This dinosaur was around 4 to 6 feet long. Number 6. The Atrociraptor This is a dromaeosaur theropod dinosaur genus that lived during the late Cretaceous period in Alberta, Canada. One feature that distinguishes this raptor from others is its short and tall skull with large serrations on its teeth, giving it the appearance of a bulky snouted animal. It is thought that the Atrociraptor had a stronger bite force than the other raptors or it may have had specialized teeth to bite differently. Jurassic World Dominion will feature the Atrociraptor, with Ghost, Tiger, Red and Panthera, which are the names of four characters of these Atrociraptors. They will face off against Blue, the Velociraptor, and we suspect that they are the same size as Velociraptors as well. And number 7. The Pyroraptor This is the one raptor that we said is rumored to be seen in Jurassic World Dominion. The Pyroraptor is the first raptor species to be positively identified in Europe. This was a small, fast-moving dinosaur hunter who lived near the end of the dinosaur era. So we can hope that this 
unique species of raptor will be seen in the movie next year, probably chasing and eating Gomsognathus. So I hope you have enjoyed watching this video anyway, with that we come to the end of it, so do hit that like button for support and subscribe as well to be a part of the MindQ family. But most of all, smash the bell icon for regular updates on new videos right here on this channel. Till the next one, take care fam.